What's poppin', baby? This is my third time. Fuck my crew retrograde. This is my third time trying to make this video. It seemed like everybody's pulling on me today. All right? I already said with the ancestors, I already blessed it. All right? If you're new to this channel, welcome. I do curse. So if cursing offends you, then baby, I'm not the reader for you. What it do talk to me, spirit family. Thank you for the love, the supports, the comments, the shares. Thank you for almost getting me up to a thousand. I am a woman of my word. Spirit in her eye is going to bless three lovely people. I'm going to pick you and you will get a past life regression. I will hypnotize you. If you want to see my diploma, baby, I got proof. All right. This is Brown Curio Reading Friday. Also, this is a portal. 5-5 five, five is a very powerful portal. So, if you want to do healing, money, power, love, today is the day to do it. Tonight, set out your attentions. Burn and release and burn three bay leaves after you release. Also, set out your crystals. All right, let's get into it. Under trouble. Someone has trouble speaking up your, thy your thyroid. You are having thyroid trouble. Either it's overactive or underactive. You need to go get a T, uh, T panel, T3, T4, uh, TSH panel, thyroid panel. Also, someone's uh, throat chakra is blocked. It's like you have an irritation of your throat or when it comes down to speaking the truth, you get choked up. Spirit is saying it's time for you to set boundaries. It's time for you to express yourself. You need to open up and tell your partner what the fuck is going on. It's okay if they get feelings hurt. If you trigger somebody, that means they have something to work on. They got healing. You need to speak up to your boss. Speak up to your parents. Tell them how you feel. Like for some of y'all, y'all been molested and raped and y'all can't hold it back no more. You need to release that and tell them your mom or your dad's not going to like it. But hey, it's no longer going to have control over you. I'm picking up a very strong masculine energy. A masculine energy can be female or male. Energy is fluid. All right. And for some of y'all, you have a, someone attacking you because they don't want you to speak the truth. OK, so you need to do a cleansing bath, cleanse your home and everything under um, trouble and friendship. Y'all trying to balance a troubled friendship. Sometimes you got to let it go. You can lead a horse to water, but you cannot make them drink. You are not Captain save a hoe. You cannot save everybody. And every time you interfere with a person's karma, it come back and hit you hard. So sometimes you just got to let it go. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. Just relax and let it go. And if it's meant to be, it will come back. All right? Under friendship. Some of your friendship keeps speaking negativity over you. You have dreams, you have vision, but Spirit has said every time you tell them your move, they crush it. Stop fucking talking. Stop telling everybody everything. Learn to move in fucking, in fucking silence. You know what I'm saying? That's what Spirit is telling me. For all my New Yorkers out there, yerp, I keep hearing that. I don't know why. I'm not from New York, but I keep hearing it. All right? A lot of y'all have a lot of snakes in y'all circle. Y'all have a circle. You said, I keep my circle small, but somebody in your circle does not like you. Someone in your circle is very jealous of you. Okay. They are very hidden. They hiding it. And for some of y'all, some of y'all friends, y'all telling y'all desire secrets going back. They not saying it's you, but they telling your business. Okay. They keeping your name out of the equation, but they are telling your business. Be careful who tells your business and they don't tell their business, okay? Because if they talking about you to somebody else, trust me, they talking about that person about you, all right? But some of y'all, y'all are going to get spiritual friends that's going to guide you and help you grow, okay? Everybody's not a bad apple. And some of y'all friends, y'all have been in a soul family. Y'all was related or y'all was married in another past life. So you're going to have a strong connection, all right? I could be talking to Aquarius, sun, moon, and rising. For someone, Spirit is saying y'all are just dating because y'all don't want to be lonely. Y'all just having sex because y'all don't want to be lonely. You don't understand. When you have sex with unclean 
people and their spirit is dirty. You can get spiritual STDs. Whatever's on them is now on you. And what's ever on them, on them, on them, on them, is all on you. So it's like you buried under a lot of stuff. You cannot be intimate with everybody. All right? Everyone does not have a clean spirit. Under lessons. Some, <coughs> sorry, spirit told me to go back. Some of y'all are born natural leaders. I know y'all don't want that responsibility, but some of y'all are born natural leaders. Get over it, all right? A lot of y'all gonna meet international friends. Remember, your soulmates is just not in the country or the state or the city or the continent. They are all over, all right? For some of y'all, y'all are going through spiritual lessons. These lessons are a teacher. When the student's ready, the teacher will appear. So some of the things that y'all going through is done by spirit to make you stronger, to help you step out in your power. And some of y'all are the victim, feeling like the victim. So spirit is making you go out there. All right. A lot of y'all are got pomegranates. I'm going to tell you about a pomegranate. Pomegranates are Cuban, Afro-Brazilian, Portuguese entities. They're very fiery. If you have a pomegranate and you're not doing what you're supposed to do, they will attack your health. So you can do what you want to do. And a lot of y'all are getting attacked because you forgot to do what spirits told you to do. Also, spirit is saying a lot of y'all are learning a lesson. Y'all going to start asking for gas money. Y'all car don't run on fumes. Your car don't run on air. Stop taking people everywhere. You're not a cab. You're not a bus. If you want to take people, then do Uber or Lyft. Spirit is saying because people are using you. Okay, for a lot of y'all, the dark class is, the dark path is leading into the good path. Your path is changing. You starting to get this good karma. All right? Also, your path is being lighted. You are being shown the way. Under break, Spirit says some of y'all are compulsive spenders. Y'all spend it. Amazon, you got stuff in your court. Now you watch TikTok, y'all going Timu crazy. You going Wish crazy. You going, uh, I don't know, these clothing stuff and you're not even wearing what you want. Spirit is saying, stop, stop, take a break. You complaining you don't got money. But look at the shit that you got. That's the reason why you don't got no money. It ain't because of bills. It's because you are spending foolishly. All right? For some of y'all, y'all need to take a break and sit and meditate and learn. Sometimes your spirits are your teachers to teach you something that humans cannot teach you. Under work. Spirit is saying y'all having problems at work. You need to take your ancestors to work with you. How do you do that, Lazare? You pour out libation. One to the left, one to the right, and one in the middle. And you tell your ancestors, it's time for us to go to work. Please accompany me to work. Please keep me safe from all this gossip and negativity. Then when you're ready to go to work, you go home, you say, let's time to go home. Before you go in the house, you pour another libation. Okay? I'm talking about Benjamin. Bentley, Benny, Beverly, Barbara, Brenda. You might live in Boston. You might live in Beverly Hills, California. You might live in Palm Beach, Florida. Somebody might be desiring and manifesting a Bentley. Someone wants a beachfront house. I'm talking about Felicia. Someone likes felines. I'm hearing Grace, Gregory, George, Gary, Gibson. If your name is Graciela, Gisela, Penelope, Pamela, Paul, Philip. Your nickname could be Peanut, Princess. Pascual, Pascal. Spirit has a message for y'all. Y'all really need to sit with spirit. Sarah, Cynthia, Sandy, Samuel, Saul, Sam. Yvonne, Yvette. A lot of y'all are feeling like y'all fell in at work. Y'all losing concentration. Spirit is saying you need to protect yourself. 
okay? A lot of y'all are in this job to learn a lesson. How are you going to go to the next chapter if you can't handle the pressure now? Y'all asking for authority. Y'all asking for a better position. But you can't handle this now. You need to learn to handle what you're going through now before you get to the next step. Some of y'all are going to be working for yourself. Some of y'all are meant to have your own business. Some of y'all business is meant to be spiritual. But how is this going to happen when you don't sit with your spirits? under home someone's home is getting attacked if you notice there's chaos everywhere money going in and out cars failing things breaking down there is someone hitting your finances spirit is saying you're going to have to rebuke that and do a reversal and start claiming your victory and your finances also spirit says some of y'all are not uh burning ancestor money some of y'all are not feeding mother nature okay giving offerings to the rivers and the lakes and the trees, to the animals, to the earthbound spirits is outside. Leaving wheat, bread, and, and milk out somewhere, fruit, and things like that. Someone is also, is war water. You have an enemy lurking around and know where you live. And they coming in when you're not home. And they dumping stuff. And when you step in it, it's bringing in uh, negative spirits. And it's just chaos. Your kids is acting up. For some of y'all, you're not making your home a house a home, okay? Something's missing. You need to sit with spirits. Also, some of y'all need to do your altar, okay? Your spirits, you're not welcoming your spirits in. You have to welcome your ancestors' spirits and your spirits is in your court. They feeling not welcome because you didn't welcome them in. You're not making them feel at home. William, Michelle, Melissa, Martha, Martin. Wanda, Juanita. Last name could be Williams. Last name could be Michelson. Tina, Teresa, Terry, Tyrone. Terry could be male or female. Tiffany, Taisha, Tiana, Tonya, Tanya. Spirit is heavily on y'all foot, so y'all need to start epping up y'all protection more. Under family, someone wants a family. But Spirit is saying you need to get yourself together. You need to get your body and your health together. Some of y'all are overweight. That's the reason why you're not having a kid. And some of y'all need to start drinking soursop, red clover leaves, eating uh, avocado. If you cut an avocado on it looks like a pregnant woman. Y'all need more vitamin C. Y'all need to take care of yourself. Start taking prenatal vitamins to boost it up. Okay, some of y'all are drinking too much, getting high too much. For some, it's not the female, it's the male. Sometimes smoking too much weed can lower your sperm cap. And sometimes wearing those tidy whities them dun -da dunts is not letting your, your huevos breathe. And that causes low semen count. So sometimes it's not the female, it's the male. All right. Sometimes the male had a, a, a injury, a sports injury that also weakened one of them, his testicles. So he needs to work hard. He also needs to take care of himself. Sour sop, I, uh, sea moss will help get the, the motion going. All right. Under family, some of y'all need to start breaking generational curses. And it starts with you. Also, some of y'all family is very protective over you. That's why everybody can't read you because they are very protected over you. I could be talking to a Sagittarius, sun, moves and rising. Also, someone is uh, has was a devotee to Shango. Okay, your family was uh, crowned by Shango. Shango is heavily around you. Also, Spirit is saying some of y'all uh, ancestors is about to do justice for you. Also, some of y'all ancestors was a devotee to Ogun. Ogun and Ifa, Ogu and Lawa. All right. So a lot of y'all, the spirits is definitely on you and they protecting you. Under gift, some spiritual ancestors about to give drop down her spiritual inheritance to you. This is a great grandmother or someone when you was younger, you see you remember them as they remember you as a baby. And when you got older, they passed. They were very spiritual. Sometimes it's hoodoo. 
And sometimes the people that was from Baptist and all this did hoodoo. So you're getting passed down your birthright. All right. This is a gift that you get ready to get. Some of y'all going to get it tonight. Some of y'all going to get it through uh, the Lions Portal 88. And some of y'all going to get it next month, 6-6. Six, six, all right. I be, could be talking to a Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Also, some of y'all, y'all gifts are going to be unlocked tonight. Okay, so you're going to be feeling unwell, uh, overwhelming. You might feel agitated. You might feel tired. You might feel like you jumped ahead, and some of y'all have jumped ahead. It's like you're going to be out of place. Your equilibrium is going to be off, but it's okay because your human body is not used to it. Um, okay, under a void. A lot of y'all need to avoid this gossiping stuff. This gossiping lowers your org field. It leaves your uh, cracks in your casita and the enemy and negative energy seeps through. Okay? A lot of y'all are avoiding sitting talking to your own ancestors. Baby, you are your ancestors. Without them, you wouldn't exist. All right? Some of y'all are avoiding eating. Spirit is saying you think you're going on a diet, but diet means die. Y'all need to do a life change. Just instead of a big plate, get a small plate. Put more colorful foods on your plate and a little bit of meat. Some of y'all are just starving yourself so y'all can get quick for summer, but y'all damaging yourself because your, your body is going in starvation mode and then your body start eating itself and it holds on to that fat. So some of y'all need to stop, all right? Some of y'all are understanding time is an illusion. Time does not exist. So some of y'all trying to rush the process. Spirit said, hold on, grasshopper. You know what I'm saying? That's why roses have thorns. Slow and steady rinse the waste. You going to get it when they say you are qualified. Some of y'all are getting access denied because y'all trying to rush and y'all not doing your part. You expect spirit to do their part, but you're not doing your part. That don't make no fucking sense. It don't. Under health. Spirit says some of y'all, the water is calling y'all. Y'all need to get to the water. Some of y'all, y'all health is going down. It's because someone is attacking y'all. Y'all going to have to start praying. Y'all going to have to start reading Psalms 91, Psalms 51, Psalms 23. Y'all going to have to send that shit back. Okay, y'all, it's time for y'all to know yourself. A lot of y'all are not going to be able to have kids because of your generational curse. Some of you notice the women in your family have complications with pregnancy. This is a curse that can be broken, okay, for some. It can be broken. And also, gossiping, negativity, speaking death over your life, not saying positivity like, I can't breathe, I, I'm broke, I'm this, I'm that. You are causing health to go down. You not forgiving yourself and others is calling health problems. Also, <coughs> Spirit is saying, someone that has a baby, <coughs> They are not, their stomach is not agreeing with that um, baby formula, okay? It's causing the baby to be gassy, bloated, cranky. The, their stools are hard. The doctors told y'all not to give them water. You can give them a little water. Put a little baking soda on their tongue, you know, just like that. That will help with the gas. But you need to ask the pediatrician to change their formula because... You're not getting no rest. The baby's not getting no rest. There's nothing attacking your baby. It's the formula. All right? Ay, Miguel. I keep hearing that name, Miguel. There is someone lying on you. I don't know what it is because they having people do readings on you or they doing readings on you and they see how Yahweh is going to bless you and they trying to lie on you, send you the evil eye to keep you down. But Spirit is saying your ancestors is, ah, you can, your ancestors is blocking that. Under health, Spirit is saying when y'all start feeling nauseated when y'all around a certain person, you need to get your fresh lime, the green one. If you can't get the green one, get the yellow one. And some water, 
and squeeze it and that would take care of that negative bug. When you start feeling that way, it's because they're sending you a parasite, a spiritual parasite. Under organized, Spirit is saying y'all going to have to learn to cut cords. You can cut cords with people alive and unalive. You need to start cutting cords to those ancestors that hurt you. You need to cut the cords to all those people that hurt you. It's okay. You say this no longer resonate with me. I give this bullshit back to you so I can heal in this lifetime. I am taking my power back. All right. A lot of y'all need to understand, be the true you. Let the world see the real you, okay? You have the chicken foot upside down. So that means your ancestors are doing the job. Y'all just need to organize, cleanse your altar. The day that you was born, so if you was born on a Monday, take that time and clean your altars and sit with your spirits. If you was born on a Saturday, take an hour, clean and sit. You could take 30 minutes, 45 minutes, an hour. You don't have to take the whole day, but you have to sit with them and honor them because they are working overtime for you, all right? For some of y'all, y'all need to see feathers. Some of y'all are finding feathers that's letting you know your ancestors are with you, your guardian angels are with you. And also, if you have shamans, sometimes shamans will give you a, a, a feather to put on your altar, all right? Also, a feather means communication. It represents air. All right? Under uh, organize, you need to organize. I don't know, y'all closet. They keep showing me a closet. I don't know if there's stagnant negative energy in someone's closet or there's a portal in that closet. That's why your energy is filling off in your house. That's why you getting attacked and everything. Something like that. You need to close that portal. You need to cleanse that area because I'm picking up a demon. A negative energy is around that. Also, you need to organize. Don't let nobody control you. You're not an animal. Okay. Your mother and father raised you or if your grandparents raised you, you are grown. You're not an animal. Start speaking up. Under intuition, spirit is saying your intuition is talking to you, it's screaming at you. It's like it's showing you stuff. Stop ignoring your intuition. 99.9% .9 of the time, you are always correct. I could be talking to a female right now that's always doubting herself. And then you hard on yourself when you're like, I should have went with my second thoughts. Those voices in your head that's telling you to do the right thing are your spirits and your ancestors. Ignore the ones that's telling you to harm someone else or harm you. Those are trickster spirits. All right. Uh, some of y'all, y'all opportunity is spirits is showing you the sign. It's time for you. You always wanted to do readings. You always wanted to step out and do live videos. Spirit said, this is your opportunity. I'm here. Denise, uh, Denver, Debbie, uh, Daniel's son. Daniel, Danicia, Danicia, Day Day, Dee Dee. A lot of y'all are missing the opportunity to close the door. Y'all ignoring it and y'all keep sweeping it under the rug. It's also, someone is thinking of doing an old fashioned wedding where you jump over the broom. Your ancestors is putting that thought in your head, okay? A lot of y'all are getting keys to go through a lot of doors. This is your year to shine, but you holding yourself back. Spirit is saying, everybody's saying, well, how can I move forward? How can I get out of my way? You are in your way. It's fear. You need to put fear and dial aside and step into that limelight and open the doors. Okay. A lot of changes are coming for you, especially starting this month. Victory is yours. Changes in relationships, changes in your gifts, all right? A lot of y'all are going to start having a, a romance. This romance, his communication is just going to say, I never heard nobody speak words that to me, and it just gave me a orgasm in my mind. No one ever talked to me this way, and all of a sudden I got wet or I got an erection. Words of your mouth when you when you get an erection or you get a, your pum pum vibrates or you get kind of moist. That is a soulmate. That is the one. When he can talk to you and it's not sexual, that is the one. And a lot of y'all going to start meeting that one for you. A lot of y'all are 
saying why I keep attracting the same type of man is because you are not ending that contract. You are not healing. You are not sitting alone to heal. After one end, you go get another one. And that's why you fucking up the rotation. Okay? Under ideas, Spirit is saying, keep your ideas to yourself. Start journeying them alone. Use your discernment on who you want to share with. Because there's people copying and pasting you. There's people that's taking you. And the next thing you know, they doing it. Spirit is saying, learn to move in silence. Stop telling everybody also about your relationship problem. Because some people are happy that you have a relationship problem. Stop getting relationship with people that never had a successful relationship. Okay? You need to start finding people that have been married for a long time. Not people that had on their eighth husband or this and this. Got ten different baby daddies. How are you going to seek relationship advice from somebody else? Also, Spirit is saying, whoever is pregnant, listen. Your child in your womb is going to tell you their name. All right? Just like you told your parent the name or whoever named you. All right? A lot of y'all, this is a man. This can be an ex-husband or ex-baby daddy that's cock-blocking you, okay? Every time you get in a relationship, it goes sour. All of a sudden, he's needy. All of a sudden, he want to come over and spend time with the kid. All of a sudden, he tells you, you know, I'm the only one that can get it wet. Next thing you know, y'all in between the sheets. Spirit says, stop doing this. If you're done with him, done with him. That's between him and the child. Let him deal with the child. You don't have to deal with him, all right? Because you want marriage, and he's never going to marry you, all right? He don't want you to be with somebody else. And also, Spirit said, whoever's trying to get married, y'all need to start doing a vision board of your marriage, all right? For some of y'all, y'all going to go to the JP, but y'all going to have a big uh, re um, recession. I think that's what it's called. I don't know. But... Start doing gift cards or whatever, whatever y'all do, writing registry. Spirit is saying you need to start doing that. For some of y'all, just ask for money so y'all can go on your honeymoon. Some of y'all are going to go like to Paris, Italy, Rome, Greece, over in Europe. I see that. I could be talking to a Gemini sun and uh, rising. Under finances, a lot of y'all are asking for more money. Y'all asking y'all ancestors and spirits to help you with more money. You are going to have to put it in. You are going to have to put the work and call them in. You are going to have to write yourself a check. Don't, don't bid yourself low. And I ain't saying say a billion dollars. Come on. Y'all know what the fuck I'm talking about. And then you're going to put the honey, the cinnamon, all that stuff on it. You're going to bury it. All right. And you're going to water it all the time like it's a plant so you can plant this piece of paper with a seed and water it each time each time you water it to say this is my money growing you need to start calling your money also you have too many attachments okay you're not building a relationship with money okay as soon as you get it you spend it all right let's see what the cards have to say once again if you're interested and any of these charms or bones, hit me up on my email. Spirit picks them out. What messages do you have for them to go along with this reading spirit? Show me clearly. Yup, a lot of y'all are connecting to the moon. Like I said, y'all intuition. Some of y'all get right growing to your gifts. 
This is the time to put your, uh, your crystals out there, make moon water, set your attentions, write on a brown piece of paper what you want to release, then afterward burn three bay leaves. Y'all are stepping into your power. Today is 5-5. Five, five. Like I said, a powerful portal. A lot of y'all are called to be that spiritualist. Y'all called to do readings, a spiritual advisor for people. If you're thinking about going live or start reading for people, Spirit is saying this is the time to start doing it. Believe in yourself and understand your ancestors, your ascended ancestors, and your spirits back you up. They want you to take that leap of faith. Stop fearing stuff. Also, a lot of y'all need to connect with y'all feminine energy. This is, excuse me, a moon where you're going to connect with your feminine energy. And that means men too. For some of y'all, once again, y'all wonder why you're not seeing your cornucopia. You wonder why you're not seeing your blessings. You need to get out of your way. You also need healing. Stop giving all the evil doers or y'all enemies all the power. Sometimes it's not them, it's you. You need to take the time and release and deal what you got going on. Some of y'all just want to point the finger at other people instead of finding out that sometimes it's really you. Okay, y'all going to get a lot of downloads tonight. Some of y'all, y'all not going to understand them. Some of y'all going to have prophetic dreams. Some of y'all going to have nightmares. Some of y'all going to have weird dreams. What you remember is a message, okay? This 5-5 five, five portal is going to start um, activating you, especially if you're from the galactic, like a star seed, is really going to do you. So you're going to get a lot of messages, all right, especially when you dream. Peace, love, and light. I say out. Uh,